Times when I know you're be lonesome. We'll Be Together Times Again is a song that's captivated generations of jazz singers. Thomas Quasthof performed his rendition on Jazz Fest Bonn's opening night. The German bass baritone has won six Echo Awards and four Grammys during the course of his classical music career. In 2012, the singer announced he was quitting the stage. Since then, he's only made rare appearances at jazz concerts. Not everything I sing is dictated by notes. It's word-based instead. Sometimes I can draw notes out or make them rougher. I'm freer in the way I deal with them, which makes things more relaxed. Many artists with powerful voices are performing at this year's Jazz Fest. Eight of its 22 concerts feature jazz singers. Lisa Bassange from Berlin is a veteran on the jazz scene. She's just released her 14th album. Her songs mix elements of pop, jazz, blues, and chanson. But Bassange doesn't like to restrict herself to any particular genre. Ultimately, it's about making the music I love and the music that gives me pleasure and doing it as distinctively as possible. It's about being individualistic and doing my own thing. Many of the Jazz Fest concerts are purely instrumental and experimental. Now in its seventh year, the festival attempts to present jazz in all its facets. On 11 evenings, relative unknowns are paired with some of the biggest names in jazz. The idea behind these double concerts is to introduce audiences to new artists. For me, an interesting jazz singer is a distinctive one, someone who's very special, an individual whose music has character, and this diversity is reflected in our lineup. Audiences like the idea, attendance is up. For musicians, festivals are always the best. You get to meet other people, exchange ideas and have fun. And I can imagine that being able to listen to different acts on a single evening really pulls in the crowds. The theme of Bassange's new album is Laurel Canyon, home to many legendary rock and pop musicians in the 60s and 70s. On it, she covers hits like The Doors' Riders on the Storm. Covering other people's songs has a long tradition in jazz. Thomas Kvasthof demonstrated his love for American jazz and its icons like Frank Sinatra, Dean Martin, and Ella Fitzgerald. A song is never the same, even if you sing it a hundred times. You always phrase things a little differently. Your condition is different each day. Your fellow musicians aren't always in the same mood. I'm not always in the same state. That keeps things new and challenging and makes them so exciting. Jazz Fest Bonn runs until May 7th, so music lovers can look forward to many more beautiful performances.